It's not even the top female streamer either. It's bullshit. That's my not slam streamer of the year award after Kaisenat and Aisho Speed lost to reverse. Oh? oh yeah, I, I, I've come across that. Um... Um, 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 um... Hmm, Twitch streamer Esmongold was completely baffled by the winner of the streamer of the year and didn't hold back with his true uh, thoughts about the awards. So first of all, let me give some context to this. It's not the streamer awards. It wasn't the streamer awards. It was eSports uh, e streamer awards. It was eSports awards. Here it is, eSports awards. To the surprise of the streaming community, Samantha Rivers, Rivera, uh, Torino emerged uh, the Esports Awards top honor on August 24th when she won Stream of the Year. Um, apparently she's a huge... What was it? Brazilian streamer? I'm not sure. Who's Rivers? Bro, I didn't hear about her either before, but... Bro, there, there are streamers outside of the English-speaking community, you know? The controversial decision rubbed many viewers the wrong way. With plenty believing that Kaisenat or Aisho Speed were more deserving of the award after the phenomenal year they've had. During a live broadcast, Esmongold weighed in on the drama and claimed Rivers only won the esports award because she's a woman. Ooh. You or something? Let's, uh, is it gonna be an out of context I'm clip? Let's that it see. It was obviously a diversity pick because she's a woman. And everybody knows it. It should have been Speed or Kai or uh, Queso or like uh, three other okay. people. Okay. You looked everybody at her stats. Knows it. It's fucking obnoxious. Or, or, e -bi. You put her up there because it's a female. It's embarrassing. And it's patronizing. It's not even a top female streamer, either. It's bullshit. It's not even one of the top female streamers, either. That is bullshit. It's not even close. Like, that's it. I'm salty that it was obviously- okay, we literally- yeah, we read that. Reverse a Mexican, it was Mexican, okay. Not was not presume it was Mexican, my bad. Yeah, Mexican streamer, average of 15,000 concurrent viewers on any Twitch given stream, and focuses on gaming and IRL content. She was able to beat out the likes of Speed, Kai, XQC, Ebi, Jinxie, and more for the crown and the shocking upset. It was boasts. By the way, this this uh, had that actually had so many people upset. I've seen how upset people were on Twitter. That is true. And to be fair, I've never heard of Rivers before this either. I've never heard of her before that either. But I am gonna say that there are large streamers outside of the English speaking community. That's a fair statement, I would say. But yet again, for some reason, she beat all of these guys. All of these guys were she beat for some reason. 15k is pretty great to be fair. It is, but she's not even one of the top females or like in the top female streaming category. So how did she win? Rivers boasts an impressive 5.5 million followers on X and another 6.3 million on Twitch. Given the fact her community is active in the esports <laughs> awards user fan voting system, it's clear that her viewers came out and forced to support their favorite viewer. Well, in that case. Well, in that case, it was just an award show that nobody else gave a fuck about. That's why. They put her up there because she's a female. It's embarrassing as Mongol continues. It's patronizing. It's not even the top female streamer either. It's bullshit. Not even close. If it wasn't rigged, if it wasn't rigged, it's because nobody gave a shit about this award show. Mm. It was because nobody gave a fucking shit about this award show. I have never heard about the eSports Awards. Have you guys ever heard about the eSports Awards? I haven't. If it's voted by the audience, then I have no complaints. If it's voted by the uh, audience and it's not... And it's not rigged. Her audience cared and the others didn't. That is true. That, that's what I'm saying. In Q2 2024, Rivers became the 10th ranked most watched female streamer. Well... 10th, 10th ranked female streamer with 2.6 million hours, quite a bit behind YouTube star Valkyrie, IL streamer, any Emirant and Mira. Holy shit. Here's Amiru. Who else is here? I, Jens, Valkyrie, Amirant. Who, who's that? Who the fuck is that? Airtime? I don't know this person. Hmm. 
No, I don't know that esports have an award. Yeah, I didn't know I yet, but I don't watch it. There we go. Everyone's still relevant. Only two coomers. According to Asmongold, the word only makes sense if you realize it has nothing to do with people's popularity or their content. And it's all about giving awards to people who they think deserve them. His comments spread to the social media, where many viewers shared a similar sentiment. Streamer of the year 100% was rigged once said. Bro's absolutely right. Kyo Speed were deserving of the award. I actually agreed. Like, personally, I would f vote for I Show Speed. Like, I Show Speed? Have you guys seen his European tour? Bro, bro had such a maturity, uh, like, um, growth, man. Bro matured so much. I Show Speed 100% deserves it. Kaisenat? Also de fucking deserves it, but I would go for I show speed. Like, personally, I would vo vote for speed. If not everyone agreed, though, with someone taking offense to Esmongold's argument, that's an incredibly sexist comment. Could also be something else, man. Another person chimed in. I, I don't know what the fuck that says. I, 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 don't, I, I don't know. Despite the backlash from Esmongold and others, on the streaming space, Rose accepted the award, saying it was for her community, and added that she hopes to one day be as good as a creator as the other nominees. Honestly, I don't think I don't think they would rig it. Personally, I don't I don't think they would rig it. I think she just chimed her community better than others. Like one hundred percent, I just think it's it's the community chiming in. I don't like. I actually don't. Th don't think a lot of people have heard about this th these awards. Old Fennec, thank you for the follow. Eric, um... Do they have a link to the... I don't... Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Um, esports awards, esports awards. People. Esports awards. 131k, bro. 131k followers on Twitter. Th that's that's nothing. The stream awards. No, that's not the one. That's German. Stream awards. Uh, okay, let's go back to the search bar. Streamer Awards. I don't know what the Streamer Awards are called. Streamer Award. Streamer Award? Just Streamer Award? Okay. Is it this? 131k? What was the esports one? Wasn't that one 13k? Esports awards. The streamer awards. Okay, they have the same number. That's interesting. To be fair, this one is also... This one is fan uh, organized. Interesting. They are the same size. Interesting, interesting. Most public voting awards composition face similar backlash as the public usually not agree. Hmm, hmm, hmm. With each other, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, I don't. I never heard anyone about talk about the fucking esports awards. Recognized excellence, creating a legacy, and honoring the esports industry. Never heard of this. Never. Public voting awards are stupid anyways. All it shows is what streamer cares enough to motivate the audience. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like about which a freaking community cares the most, usually. That is very true. Next mobile game esports. Nah, let's hope not. Let's hope not. 